Hello, I'm Gary Tasman with Cushman & Wakefield Commercial Property, Southwest Florida, and I'm here on location talking about what's developing next in Southwest Florida's commercial real estate market. We're at I-75 and Alico between Daniels and Alico with the airport right behind us, and we're talking about the new development that's occurring in this submarket. To my right is the new Dr. France corporate headquarters. This is a local eye physician who's built a great business and is continuing to expand his business as we continue to expand in Southwest Florida. I'm also right beside the Neogenomics corporate headquarters. And this is again, an expansion of a local business that has benefited from the growth and the expansion of our, of our area. And it has a lot to do with the quality of life we have here and the economic drivers that we've created that's gonna to continue to propel our market forward as we continue to grow and receive new, new residents. It's interesting to, to see how this area is developing and really what it is is a rationalization of the market as we have continued to get critical mass. So we've got the traffic corridors and the transportation corridors of I-75, obviously the airport as a big economic driver, and we have land that's getting developed now. And so if you look across I-75, you'll see that there's another 150 acres fully approved, fully developed, under contract, and ready for the next wave of development. We're gonna see this development occur along I-75 with these types of tenants, corporate headquarters, very prestigious, high profile users that wanna be where the future is, that wanna be where the employees are, and that wanna be in locations that have access and mass to be able to continue to grow to support our growing market. I'm Gary Tasman with Cushman & Wakefield Commercial Property, Southwest Florida. Thanks for joining us on location at Alico and I-75 at the Neogenomics and Dr. France corporate headquarters. Make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can keep abreast of what's developing in Southwest Florida.